guys, me and John are at the Ogden Cemetery, not Fort Ogden, but Ogden Cemetery, the little tiny cemetery that is inside of Ogden Park, uh, where the King family is buried. And the last two times that we have come here, we have gotten some amazing responses on the spirit box um, to the point to where they were answering almost every question up to even saying their names. So we came here tonight to try and communicate with them again and use the necrophonic and the SLS to um, see if we can get any more responses from them. So let's go guys. Okay guys, here it is. Again, we've been here two other times and both times we get some amazing responses on the spirit box. We even seen like a figure on the SLS that was kind of hanging out on this gravestone here. There are how many burials did we count before? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. About ten or eleven burials here total. And again, this is the King family, or most of them, anyways. Um, I do believe that some of their last names also are Florida, because there's two gravestones over here that say Florida, but it's kind of dark to see, and the um, the gate over there is closed, so we can't walk into it. As you guys can see, it is dark all the way around. So yeah, that's really creepy. I wanna do a necrophonic and an SLS to see if we can pick up what was over here before. Last time we were here, we got this chain to This move. chain was moving, yeah. Yeah, like this. Yeah. Back and forth. Swaying back and forth. It was pretty cool. And it was going for a good amount of time. It just kept swinging and swinging and it wouldn't stop for a while. John actually had to stop it the last time because it wouldn't stop. It just kept going. All right, guys, John is breaking out the necrophonic so we can try and talk to these guys again and see what we can get. <laughs> King, immediately, did you hear that? Is anybody here with us today? Me? I heard me like three times. Yeah. Who is me? Can you tell us what your name is? Oh. That was just going off. I heard Zeba. Is this Zeba? Oh. If anybody is here, can you touch this meter to make it light up? Who's here with us? Are any of the King family here? Joe? I heard Joe too, yeah. Is there a Joe? Grab your spotlight and see if there's a, a Joe on any of these uh, gravestones. I don't think there is. Okay, I just heard a noise behind me. It is dark, guys. It is dark. It is so dark. How many spirits are here right now? Two? Oh. Did you say there was two spirits here? Yes. 
What are the names of the spirits that are with us? Leave, guys. Did you say leave? Is there anything that you want to say to us? It must be miserable being laid to rest here with all the noise of the traffic and the loud vehicles all the time, I could imagine. It's a very loud area. Is there anything that you want to tell us about the afterlife? Scary? I heard two people say it's scary. Did you say that it's scary in the afterlife? Can you touch my meter, the K2 meter, to confirm that you're here? Make it light up. I just, I just heard like, like a tapping noise or something in here. Yeah, me too. Did you? Yeah. I just heard leave. Get out. You guys are famous for saying... For saying that. Did you hear that? That was creepy. We're hearing like tapping noises inside of here. Can you tell us who's making that noise? Good morning. It's nighttime right now. It's not morning. Is Zeba King here with us? I know you were last time. Can you can you say your name like you did the last time? I just heard King. All right, we're gonna break out the SLS app, guys, and see if we can see anything again. The last time we used that here, we seen a stick figure here on this grave, just standing like kind of next to it with their hand on it. And then we seen one over there, like off in the distance by that bench, which you can't see because it's super dark, but we're gonna see if we can catch something again. Yeah, it's not there like it was before. Yeah. The spirit that we seen standing against this headstone the last time. I don't see it though. I don't see anything. I hear it. Can you show yourself again? I keep hearing the noises, but I don't see anything. That's that headstone right there that's making that do that. Or how about over here where we've seen one? Nope. Now, didn't we see something last time over in the trees? Over here? Over by that bench, yeah. yeah. Oh! It's... It's there, like... I can see something. Look, come here. Oh, wow. That's, yeah, yeah, I have the light. Go with it. 
Now, the last time we seen something over there, it was a lot smaller and it was like over like kind of like beyond that bench. Yeah. This time it's like right here in front of us kind of thing. Is that a spirit that we see? If it is, can you walk closer to us? Now we turned off the necrophonics so we don't have the spirit box, but I know that some of you have the capabilities of speaking right into our microphone. So if there's anything that you want to tell us that you were unable to communicate through the spirit box, if you have enough energy, go ahead and speak right into my microphone. The bugs, oh my God. Hello. Hello. Just shut off on me. What? Yeah. Okay, we have another device you can communicate with us through. Do you guys want to say anything to us? Is there anything that you want us to know? That was creepy. Would anybody like to communicate with us? I just heard like an... What the hell was that? Who's here with us? Is there any spirits that want to communicate? I just felt like something like, like, like right next to me. What? Yeah, I just felt like something like, you now somebody walks up to you and you feel that, kind of breeze, but that feeling of yeah. energy near you, that's what it just felt like on the side of me. Wow. Like something, it's like somebody walked past you? Yeah, or you know, just like stood, be, stood on the side of me. It was really weird. Is there anybody standing next to John? Did you hear that? Yeah. I was like... What? Do you still feel it? No, it was just like for a quick second. Was there a spirit next to me? All right, well, we're gonna get going. That was totally a little kid's voice. Can you come through again? We're going to be leaving soon, so you only have a few minutes to let us know what you want to let us know, if anything. Anything you want to tell us at all, let us know. What? I was hearing stuff behind me about dinner with wars. All right. So we're going to get going and you are not allowed to follow us. You have to stay here. You are not allowed to, to attach yourself to either one of us. It's like they're crying. Do you, do you not want us to leave? And I'm starting to get really creeped out. We keep hearing noises around us. John felt like Somebody walked past him and like kind of stood next to him. Yeah, those are some few creepy things that came through. Yeah. 
definitely all right guys we're gonna head out of here a uh, couple creepy things happened actually um a lot of responses coming over uh, several spirit box apps that we used and of course the sls we were able to pick up a couple of um apparitions stick figures what have you i don't know what you would call them and then of course john had a feeling of somebody like walking past him he could feel like the breeze as if somebody walked past him and like the energy that you would feel of somebody standing like right next to you and that's what he felt and it kind of freaked him out a little bit yeah so again we're gonna get out of here and i'm gonna go home and sift through the uh, necrophonic and a couple of the other voice box uh apps that we use to see what we can find so uh we're being watched by a cop guys so we're gonna get out of here don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to my channel and click the little bell icon that's located next to the subscribe button so that you are notified every time i upload a video is he still is he no. watching us no, he's gone. okay <laughs> all right ready okay all right guys we're gonna head out take care